Greetings in the name of our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ. Thank you for watching Charis TV. Today we are here in Charis Missionary Church, Tembisa, next to Pumlan Mall Auditorium. And you are with the people who have been supported by Apostle J.V. Maganisa and Prophetess T.E. Maganisa. And they will be telling us on how the church is helping them. Some of them, they are going to school. Some of them, men of God and the women of God, are helping them to pay for their fees and their rent and they'll be actually telling us for how many years have been they supporting them and we'll be hearing from all of them and today with me i'm with one of the sisters who have been helped by our spiritual parents and she'll be introducing herself to us hi my name is Munewa larumbe i stay around here tembisa next to pumlan Mall. i stay in zone five uh, mommy and daddy they've been helping me paying for my fees um, they're giving me money for transport, buying textbooks and everything. So um, it's been three years, yes. This is my last year studying as a civil engineer in Pretoria. So they're helping you only with the money of going to school? Yes, they're paying for my fees only, yes. And this is your last year? Yes, this is my last year. And, and how are you feeling? Yo, I'm so happy now. Yo, I, you have no idea how happy I am. and. I believe that as this is my last year, this, it will be a breakthrough for in my family, you know, at least there will be someone who is educated in my family. So you're trying to tell us that you're the first person to be going to school? Exactly. I'm the first person who passed my trick in my family and I'm the first person who's studying at, yes, at college. Uh, I'm Tepo Sibusi. I live in Tembisa. And then I'm here today um, because the church is helping us in terms of paying rent and food for us. For how long? Um, actually, I, I, before I even started working, I was, I was working at Liberty. So my, my contract uh, was ended. So um, the church helped me. I think it was in 2013 if i'm not mistaken summer 13 and 14 and then i got a prophecy from daddy that i'm going to get another job so i got um, uh, the job at transnet and then i worked at transnet everything was well and then a lot of things happened when they were retrenching people so we we're part of the contractors there so now we, we our contract also ended due to issues at transnet and then the church started now, I think it was on 2017, uh, March. So the church started to help me because I was getting UIF. Uh, I got UIF for something like eight months. And then the church started helping me, uh, I think, um, this year, Jan or Feb. Yes, thank you. And, and as they have intervened in your matter, how are you feeling? To be honest, I'm feeling very much relieved because uh, by the time I presented my case to the church, it was not easy, you know, uh, on my side and my family. I remember I approached um, um, Malehodi, which is the, the, the lady who helps us here at church. And then um, Malehodi spoke to Mama. And then after Pastor Malehodi spoke to Mama, and they agreed on helping us. So now uh, they did help us, and to us, it's a serious relief. Yeah. And as you are having a relief knowing that your rental issue is covered, you and your family, you know that even though anything can happen during the month, you're still going to sleep under a roof. What can you say to Charis partners and our spiritual parents as they are taking part into helping you and your family? Um, to be honest, uh, I would like to say to Cherish Partners, thank you a lot. And then may God increase, you know, wherever you, you are taking. Because to be honest, you are helping us a lot. Uh, many lives have changed. Maybe um, some of us, you know, were supposed maybe to be Tzotzis or something. Because sometimes when you are in the corner, you don't know what to do. Satan speaks a lot. And now, because of that, many souls have been saved. And then many souls now, um, at least, you know, you, you, when you've got a roof, it's easy for you to read the Bible, it's easy for you to think, it's easy for you, 
you know, to look for a job without stress, because at least, you know, there is something that the church is doing. So I would like to thank our parents because they've been doing this for, for a long time now. They've been with us for some time and with the church partners, they are helping us a lot. My name is Esther Legabe. Um, I'm here to receive my monthly rent money, yes, from mommy. They're supporting me financially, so yeah, that's the reason why I'm here. For how long have they been helping? Since three, it's three years now. It's three years since I lost my job, so they've been helping me with rent. Mm -hmm. And tell us, before the church intervened in your matter, what was really happening in your life? What would you do in order for you to pay your rent? Um, for me, luckily, I went to mommy immediately after I was stopped at work. I explained to her my situation and says, she said to me, I shouldn't worry about rent, she will pay for my rent. And how are you feeling about that? It's a relief because I don't have support from anyone. It's only the church that is supporting me, so it's, it's a relief. At least I know the way I put my, my, my head every night, it's fully catered for. Unlike not knowing what will happen, it's month eight now, I'll be stressing, needing money for rent, but the, the church has been playing a big, big, big part in my life. My mother is a pensioner, she can't even afford to pay for my rent. But how are you feeling right now as everything is covered? It's a sign of I'm relieved. I, 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 I sleep I, I sleep with 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 a with 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 with, with a, a sound soul, sound mind and sound everything. So I'm at peace. I am at peace. Words of encouragement or what can you say to other partners of Charis Missionary Church? Partners of Charis Missionary Church, thank you very much for your support. You are not only doing that for Charis TV to go on, even us, you are also helping us, the needy, those who are unemployed, you are also helping us continue to support us. And make My name is Tukulo Chikunguru. The boy is standing next to me. It's my son, Blessing Chikunguru. I'm here to come and collect the money for his own lunchbox and clothes and my own money for food and for school of fees, yes. For how long have the church been helping you with that? Firstly, they started to help me last year by money for food and for this young man who's standing next to me. And this year, it's where I decided to go to school. Then I told mommy that I wanna go to school. Then she gave me the support. She said to me, go on and find the school. After then, you can come and tell me whatever that you got. So you're trying to tell us that they're paying, uh, giving you money for food, paying, uh, giving your son a lunchbox money, and they're also buying uniform for him. And also, they are paying school fees for you. Yes, yes. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Even money for food in our, in like in our house, not only for lunchbox, even for food. Yes, so they are maintaining us in everything that we need. And before they did that, how was life for you? What has really happened? Yeah, it was very hard because money for grant was not helping me. Sometimes you find that I'll even go on asking. Sometimes we, we could not have even food. But through mommy, we got the support that we needed, like everything as well. Yes. And you spoke about the issue of school. Were you having hope that you go back to school again? Ah, no, because I've been applying all around. There was no lucky, but as I spoke to mommy, it was only only for 30 minutes. Then she said, okay, everything it will be well. So go on and think about what you want to do. Because I was confused, I was happy. I didn't know what to do. But then she said, anything that you want to do, I will assist you. And how are you feeling? Oh, I'm excited. Yeah, I'm, 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 I'm overwhelmed, like, ah, there, there is joy, because I know that this year I'll be obtaining whatever that I want to do, then I'll be happy that I know that I'm going to learn and come back and work for my family, yes. My name is Tewe Khaletoalo, I'm from Winnie Mandela, on 10 Tembisa. Uh, the person that is next to me, she's my daughter, she's Kilewe uh, Khaletoalo. Today we are here at Charisma Church, we are here to collect money to pay rent. 
and our parents say hey, that the one who are taking care of us in, in everything that doing uh, they're doing everything for us even my daughter if you can see her the clothes that she's wearing the uniform the one that she's wearing that the one who bought her uniform some clothes foods and everything yeah he's so yeah we, we are very grateful to have people like them especially here around him besides before they did that for you, what is really happening in your life? What would you do in order for you to buy food and to pay rent? Yo, yo, it was not easy. I'm telling you, it was not easy. I remember there was a time where that I had nothing. I had nothing, so I, I was I had to go out to find someone like as a boyfriend. Actually, I was a, I was a prostitute, so it, God saved me for that. I was a drunkard. Ish, a lot has happened. So I used to go out to find someone who's going to take care of me and my daughter. It was hard, I'm telling you, it was hard. So it's, uh, it's really we thank God, we thank God. It was hard, it was hard. But how are you feeling right now? Yeah, I'm very happy. I'm very happy because I, I'm no longer like worried. I know charity is home, where there's happiness and everything. They're praying for us, they're praying for our family. You know, you know when, you, when you have a problem, you can come here. Your life will never remain the same. Yeah, he's and is the first year of your daughter at school. Yes, it is. It is. It is. And when she was still going to daycare, were they taking care of her? Uh, yeah, they were. They were because they. Mama used. Mama, she's buying her clothes each and like every month. In two months, she she buy her clothes, foods, and everything. Since she was eight, maybe eight months up until now. How old is she today? She's six years. From when she was eight months till today when she's six years they've been taking care of her yes yes and what can you say to mommy and daddy and also Charis partners what i can say to mommy and daddy and, Ch and Charis partners and all the people of the whole the world i would like to say uh, thank you mama thank you daddy thank you for your, your appreciation we love you we love you so much god must continue to bless you Thank you so much. Thank you so much. You've been there for us. You took us from zero up until now, and we're still hoping that God is going to doing doing a lot. God is going to continue to bless you up until up until, and we'll we'll keep on praying for you. Praying for you. We love you. We love you so much. Thank you, Mommy and Daddy, and tell us about this. My name is Molly. I'm from Centurion, and I am here to collect my grocery money for the month. And for how long have they been helping you with that? Um, Mommy and Daddy have been helping us for the past four years. Yes. And how is it helping you? Tell us what is really happening in your life before they intervened in your situation. Mommy and Daddy are really helping us because um, before they intervened, there was nobody there. And our lives were actually hopeless at that moment. And yes, they've really given us hope. Yes, and um, it helps you to concentrate on your relationship with God, not thinking about what you're going to be eating, um, how the ch children are going to be getting to school, um, a lot of things, yes. And since well, they're helping you with that, how are you feeling? Oh, I feel so blessed. To, that um, God has allowed them to actually help me. I feel very blessed and I believe it's um, the favor of God. Yes. Words to Charis partners and also Mommy and Daddy. Um, to Mommy and Daddy, I'd like to say um, thank you so much for what you are doing for our family and for giving us hope and for helping us to believe and to stick by the truth. Yes, that's what I'd like to say to mommy and daddy and for teaching us how to be to be and to become better givers in the future. Um, don't count how many times you've helped somebody. Just keep on doing good and um, everything will be returned back to you. To um, the charities partners out there, I'd like to say um, keep on supporting the ministry. Um, you're supporting a lot of people. There's a lot of us and... Um, Keep on, keep on giving, support, support the ministry because the ministry is doing so much. Thank you very much. Uh, my name is Katlaus Khovela. I'm from here in Tembisa, Zone 5. Uh, today I'm here to receive um, money from mommy and daddy from my school. Uh, they've been supporting me from uh, 2016. 
Yeah, they've been supporting me since I started my tertiary um, education. They've been supportive to me. And they even promised me that even if I fail, he's going to take me to school. Because I remember uh, in 2016, I was confused, you know, after my trick on what I was going to do. I wanted to go straight and start my own business. Uh, but daddy said I must go to school. And I was in denial, actually. He said to me, isn't it that you've passed the matric with a uh, distinction? I said, true. He said, yeah, you should go to school. Even if you fail, I'm going to pay. And then I went to school. It was not easy, though, because I remember there was this day on Wednesday. He called me to pray for me again because I was still confused. But since he said I must go to school, I've been excelling in my school work. I've been passing with distinctions. Glory to God. Last day, it was my final year. Uh, this year I'm doing my practicals and I'm about to finish and during this month I'm going to graduate. Um, yeah. And how are you feeling about that? And are you the first person to go to school in your family or, or, or tell us tell us details? Um, yes, in my family I'm the first person to go to tertiary. Um, in my family most of them they ended up in matric. They didn't go to tertiary because of financial uh, difficulties and constraints uh, but by the grace of God I was able to break this barrier by the grace of God my sister now got a scholarship to start at UNISA and I thank God for that because it was my cry to say God I cannot break this uh, case of poverty alone you know they say unity is power so I'm so glad that God is working I broke that case of poverty and I managed to reach a tertiary level and I just want to say um, mommy and daddy, they've been supporting me um, to extend that everything that I needed. I never lacked anything while I was at school. If I would go to them and say, at school they need one, two, three, they would say, don't worry, we'll pay for it. Yes. And how are you feeling about that? Uh, I'm so happy. Actually, I've, I have the feeling of victory because Ah, when I started, I never thought to worry, I will finish because this journey has been long. But mommy and daddy, they've been supportive, not financially only, but counseling us, praying for us, guiding us. It has, it has brought so much difference. And I, I believe as you are here, there are many people out there who are watching you. And what can you say to Charis partners and also to our spiritual parents as they're pray, playing a big role in your life? Uh, first and foremost, I will talk about mommy and daddy. I will say this to mommy and daddy. Mommy and daddy, uh, keep on supporting us. Keep on um, plowing back to the community. Keep on giving to the needy. Because what you're doing, you're producing business people like us who are upcoming. Um, what I can say is you are making our dreams a reality. And for that I'm so grateful because if it was not because of your support, some of us were going to be outcast. I didn't have purpose personally. I didn't know what to do in life. But your support has brought so much difference in my life. And um, to the viewers out there, especially uh, Charis partners, I would love to say keep on supporting this ministry because your contribution to this ministry is bringing so much difference. You don't know how much that amount of money you're, you're, you're sowing to the church or to the account of the church is bringing to the life of many. As you can see, we are many here, and they didn't mommy, I can promise you, they're supporting us, and they never complain. That's what I know. Thank you for supporting us through your contribution to the ministry. Thank you. Sir. Thank you.